Yo, what is up everybody? It's your boy Royce and today we'll be watching and continuing Sword Art Online Elucidation War of the Underworld episode 19. In the previous episode, I was a bit, you know, kind of hyped because Kirito woke up a little bit. But hopefully in today's episode, he's fully woke and probably in the last couple episodes towards the end of this season, he's going to do some crazy stuff as we all know him for since the best season, which was season 1. So let's get started. Sorry, I look really ugly and I'm gonna be eating food, so. Oh, wait, I grabbed the meat. Can you the sound? There we go. Oh, Kirito! You welcome back, Kirito! You my ham sandwich? Man, everyone has a crush on him. It's kinda of weird. He goes gay for Kirito. All the girls like Kirito. Yujo went gay for Kirito. What's next? The whole world? Mm hmm. You tell him. Alright. Like, just imagine, like, this whole show, or like this whole anime, is just based. Of this guy's obsession for Kirito. That's so lame, honestly. When you look at other anime like Ajin, The King's Avatar, or Dr. Stone, they have like way much better, I don't know how to say it, uh, direction in the story. This one is just like Kirito's the center of it all. I kind of dislike it. But it's whatever. Like, it's kind of, this this story of this anime is kind of self-centered, honestly. Like, maybe the author is trying to portray himself as Kirito or something. Or, I don't know, you know, I don't want to say anything bad. So I'll just leave it at that. That's only sometimes some authors do that. Awakening. Hmm. Two years? That's not that long. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. You're just standing there. Alright, that's lame. What a lame, I don't know, uh, provocation. Provocation? No. I don't know that word. What's the word? Provoking? You know what I'm talking about. Can't think right now, you know. I gotta drink some milk. Almond milk. Oh, yeah. I just felt the. The chills down my spine when she said that. I'm gonna drink that almond milk. I felt like Yujiro inside of. He's coming. He's coming, bro. He's coming for you. Um. All right, that's just fine.
Oh, yeah, let's go. Oh, it takes the memory away. No, no, he he sucked their power. Uh oh, we got another one. It's you gay, bro? They they figured it out. They're like, damn, this guy likes Kyoto so much. That's gross, man. He has nothing else in his life. What's wrong with him. That's why they don't go to him. They're like, damn, Kirito, he knows what he wants. He wants all these women. <laughs> They're like, you just call this store out online. The hair of Kirito, season four. I don't see any other point in this story, honestly. Like, I thought, you know, it's supposed to be about the Flocklight stuff, right? I mean, we hardly even hear anything about that anymore. Wow. Oh, please, not another tentacle scene. All right, thank goodness. Why doesn't he run at him? Did he just degrade in his brain cells or some shit? All right, this battle just went from 100 to zero real quick. He's literally letting him power up. That guy's dumb. I don't feel sorry for him anymore. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me he's bringing out his, his OG clothes. Oh my god. I knew it. Let's go, baby. The Black Swordsman is here. Black Lives Matter. They're like... They got wet after seeing that. <laughs> oh my god, man. That, that's so weird. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Yep, yep, yep. You said it, bro. Dragon Ball Z. Let's go. Kirito versus... I have no idea who that guy is again. Fight! Looks like Kirito's going down for the lower ground. But no, he's coming back in. We had a double sword attack, which got deflected. Now he's up in the air. It's perfect time for a strike. Oh, secret attack of the first element. Kirito strikes back. Menacing blow. Within the smoke, he brings out a sneak attack. But with his quick, adept awareness, he kicks Kirito super hard and he's already flying around. Re-engaging again. Oh, looks like he's going to power up with a super attack. Using the Shadow Clone Jutsu, Kirito is like, oh shit! Powers up his sword, getting ready for a vertical, horizontal, six-chain combo strike. Uh-oh, it looks like it ran out. Kirito, what are you going to do? Brings out the second sword skill in the second leg. He does a, 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 I don't know, a thrust. I don't know what he calls that move. But it looks like it's a very powerful... Both of them are battling at it at their maximum powers. But it looks like his sword is about to give in. As a stab beats a slash every time. As seen in RuneScape, there's no way you can beat a, beat a, a thrust. A devastating cut on an enemy's wrist, Kirito unleashes a powerful blow. Ooh, and just like that, we see a, you know, we call that the nuclear slash right there. Nuclear thrust. As I might say. Oh, and we don't have to see that. Yeah, he lost a lot of his body. Yeah, he's still alive. And that concludes our fight. It looks like Kirito has won, obviously.
Where are the cops when we need them, man? Oh, snap. Everyone's literally just standing there. Damn, I need that. Where's my healing, bro? Here to heal me too. I'm dying here. Bro, he is the spotlight. I don't know what you're talking about. <clears throat> what are they talking about? He was he was right there. Of course he's gonna win. I was actually all surprised and shit. They're like, oh shit, what's happening? Mm-hmm. And no, no one cares about you, Geo, man. That sucks. What about you, Geo, man? He helped you. Man. Kirito, you suck. You don't even say, like, thanks to you, Geo, for his spirit to help me. That's messed up, author. You, you freaking like stealing all the credit. Mm -hmm. All right, that that deserves its moment, you know. Kirito was gone for like how many episodes? There goes Superman. Mm hmm Oh. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. Oh, I don't even know what happened to this guy because who cares? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dude. Damn, they have a lot of people. I didn't even know that.
Damn, they suck. Just like League. And I was cheering for them in League. Holy crap. That doesn't sound good. That's not good. Uh oh. Five million. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why don't they have armor? Uh huh. Nice going. What about all the other players? Like, they're all stuck there. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Please, hurry up, Kirito. Get out of here. What? Forget about her. Yeah, dude. Obviously. Wait, it's only been a day? I keep forgetting. Yes, 10 minutes. Well, knowing him, maybe he could teleport to the console, you know? Like, just like that. Hopefully. She doesn't even know. They're wasting time talking, so it's already 8 minutes now. That makes no sense. Alice looks fine, honestly. She looks fine. She's doing fine. Is that even happening? Oh, she's running away. Mm-hmm. Farewell. Dude, that's sad. Oh, 
Oh man, poor dragons. Be free, dragons. No, forget about him. Live your life. Otter oh, dead. Why? Why dragons? Oh shit. No, just run away, please. Come on, dragons. Come on, Kirito, get in there, boy. Finally, save those baby dragons. Let's go. Get him, boy. Where's Asuna? He like just threw her away. Young man versus deprived office worker. Find out who wins in the next episode. Sword Art Online. Alright, so, you know, as I said in previous episodes, we're just going to totally throw the story out. Just rate it on the action. This one, strong 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. I really enjoyed it, you know. Kirito's back. Yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in my next video. Probably episode 20 is going to be, you know, like a, a slow paced episode. We're going to see more recollection of everybody, you know, cheering on and everything. And they'll probably obviously escape with Alice and she'll be in that robot that we saw previously. And, uh, you know, that Japanese something ships federation will come in there, rescue them. Episode 20 is going to be good. And episode 21, who knows? It's probably going to be like more personal life stuff. So. I look forward to that. Hopefully, we'll get a story that doesn't kind of revolve around Kirito entirely, even though that's pretty much every season. So yeah, I'll see you in my next video. And don't forget, if you're looking for an alliance in Fantasy Star Online 2, be sure to check out TeamHonors.com or come to Block 14 on Ship 1 and look for anyone in Team Happy because we are a coalition. Thank you again.